So I recently got myself a, Lum a um, Nokia Lumia, Nokia Lumia 920. I uh, just needed this real quick. Um, I was targeting the 1020, but I'm gonna get the 1020 later. But I got the 920. So this is literally how it is. Well, this is my first Windows Phone, and I'm really satisfied with its with the experience of it. Um, I'm gonna like show a little clips of the durability of this machine oh or this smartphone is and it's absolutely fabulous uh, from the from this video that I saw um, and I was amazed by it so literally the screen doesn't really really doesn't break until it takes an ex extreme beating and the scratches are scratches you can always get a always get a cover but I was just more focus on the screen breaking and the impact that it needs to break. So I might show a little clip of it or I might leave a description, link description of the video. All right, let's go ahead and see what happened. Uh, touchscreen seems to be working just fine. Anyway, so this only comes with um, the one that I got is like uh, 32 gigs. There's no ex there's no um, micro USB or USB slots, so you just get 32 gigs. Or I think there's more, but I'm not too sure. More option or less th these options, but that's the th that's the storage. Uh, there's one one um, gigs of RAM and it's a dual core. So the speed is dual core, but that does that doesn't really matter for what I got for. I got it for the camera, and I got it for the um, the phone itself, and I got it for the uh, web browser, web browsing. So uh, this thing does do uh, 110, 180p um, video recording. It also does front recording too. The front front recording is I think 720. Um, I think the megapixel. I'm not too sure, but doesn't really matter about the megapixels. The picture takes about maybe maybe eight megapixels. I don't know. I'm not too sure, but it's more or less. But the camera itself does hundred. The camera itself does hundred um hundred eighty p. So that really matters. The video camera. So um to hmm, this this your microphone microphone grooves over here um. Headphones plugins over here. So if you were to were to um, use the headphone, it'll be on the top like this, and you'll look like this in the streets. So it's not on the floor. It's not over here. So it'll be over here. The thickness of it is really thin. And it's glossy, some kind of military plate or something, the glass. It's very, very sturdy. Absolutely, absolutely um, amazed by this quality, the build quality of it. The buttons over here, up and down, volume up, volume down, power, powers over here, and this is probably your video camera, sh uh, camera button. Down here is your micro USB and two speakers over here, and there's um, micro screwdriver slots. It uses it uses uh, hexagon hexagon screwdrivers, but I'm pretty sure you could use um, cross cross mini screwdrivers to open that. And I'm not gonna open it because I don't need to open it. So AT and T, um, Nokia. And this is your back button. Um, your Windows Home button and search button. It's very, very, very slick, sleek. Um, your flash over here, camera over here, and 
like a design over here. So that's your outer parts and buttons. So to to turn it on, you press this button here, and it has your. You can only customize the the lock-in screen, and you could have the option to turn the phone to lock the phone with password or to not. Pretty sure it's better if you lock it with a password, but if you don't, it's okay also. This is your um, your home but home menu. So literally, it's like your desktop. Your desktop, uh, desktop um, home desktop. <sighs> like I'm not saying your desktop, your display desktop. You know, you know what I mean. Like in Windows, you have your desktop, not not the computer, not the hard hardware itself, but the the place. You go. Oh my God! Getting confused. Um. You can always customize these. These and this is my first. Like I said, this is my first uh, Windows phone. And absolute. Some people don't like this. Like this. Um. OS. But I like it. Like I've never had it. I. I. I just. I've been using it for three days and it's absolutely simple. Um. I had no problems with it. However, I did have problems. However, I did have problems when I first turned it on. When I first turned it on, I tried to connect to um, a Microsoft account, live live account, or Microsoft account in general. You could use Hotmail, you could use Out Outlook, you could use Live. Um, it had the problem where it, it had the problem where I couldn't use any AMP or I couldn't use any functions because I couldn't log in to my Microsoft account because my phone was not updating the date and time correctly so therefore to fix this you gotta turn off the automatic automatic date and time and manually set the correct time the date and your your time zone so I'm in the, I'm in the eastern eastern time eastern uh, Pacific eastern Pacific eastern time zone. So I set it there, um, and I reset my phone. I shut down and restarted, it, and then I was able to log in. If you have any other problems after you did that, I will link you the description of the exact. Um, Exact, exact information that I, it, it helped me with and that will solve your problem. But that was the only problem I had right off the bat. Um, I don't know how the battery last will last me but it, it took me like five hours for full, full charge so I'm pretty sure it will, it will give me more than the Blackberry tablet that I had, or or it will give me more than the, um, maybe the iPad, or it'll give me similar battery life. Uh, first, let's go to the amp. Right? People complain about the amp of the window Windows amp, but I have absolutely no problem with the amp itself. Or the app store itself. So you go to this like you could either go you you could either go store over here from this way, or you could there's only two so there's only two um display or desktop. So you go there's one here and there's one here and there's no other. There's nothing. See. So either you could do it this way, the store over here, or you could just uh, go to the store over here. So this is the Nokia collection, I guess, Nokia store. There's amps, there's games, there's music, there's podcasts. So there's amps, there's games, and there are top free games, and you could always install any game you want, which I already did. But you need your Microsoft account, you need to log into your Microsoft account. 
and I hope you guys don't have any problems logging into your account. If you are having it, like I said before, to fix it, uh, fix your time zone and your current date. So blah blah blah, I go to games, I go free, free game, top free, there's so much, there's hundreds of this, hundred, top hundred. Um, if you don't like top free, go, you can go, you can go new plus rising, Xbox, something best rated, collections, pick for your, picks for you. It's awesome, I think. So to give you a, uh, example, a sample of the game, you go to games, you could always customize this through this. To customize that, you go, you could always ping to start. Oops, 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 oops. So you could like ping to start. It's like very, if you're familiar with Windows, it's like very familiar, very similar. Like ping to start, ping to menu, and it will show up here. If you really don't, if you want to get rid of something here, you hold on to that thing. And then you have the option to erase or to expand or disband. Anyway, to back to the game. So you go to games, right? Give you a sample of Angry Birds. Angry Birds, the Angry Birds you gotta play in the portrait. So you get the idea of the, of the, how, how it games. Uh, that's absolutely fabulous, good enough for me, but I'm not, I didn't get it for games. Uh, there, a uh, bad, so the amps, so you go to, you go to the same thing, you go to stores, go to amps. Oh, uh, there's hundreds from this you could choose from. Go to top free, and I did a lot of stuff, I did Facebook amps, um, I did a lot. So basically what I did, what I got was like, uh, Google Amp, Google Mail, Flashlight. So everybody knows the Flashlight Amp. Uh, got the battery life, battery amp. Tells you like stuff. Uh, got the YouTube Amp. Uh, I prefer this YouTube Amp. There's three YouTube Amps. I prefer this because you can comment and stuff. Um, there's Facebook amps, there's Twitter amps, there were radio amps, there were, um, but like individual amps, I think, like, like unique amps or whatever unique, like creative amps, maybe those amps people complain about, like they prefer the Apple open amp, open amp store or whatever. These amps were like I don't know I'm not I'm not I'm not sure but it's like it's limited it's not that creative but if you just need a few amps for a few stuff then this is it um there's stop stopwatch amp stopwatch there's my notes everybody you go everybody knows that that kind of amps um there's like a recorder amp where you could record voice I think um. The stopwatch amp, you could use it as, as a stopwatch. You know, I'm not complaining about, uh, people shouldn't be complaining about the amp store. Thing is pretty sim pretty same as Blackberry amp store, pretty same as every amp store except for Windows amp, or uh, Apple's amp store, or Android amp store, where it's free and people could develop stuff. It all depends how many people are creating amps for that particular thing. 
like I said, this is like maybe few creators and there's more creator of amps in the open amps. But no, I'm not, I don't really care about amps. So if you if amps is your thing to get a smartphone, research it for yourself. It will be better. Okay, so we got rid of the amp. We got rid of okay. Um, oh, there's few. Oh, there's few standard amps that's already installed. There's you got your mail. It's pretty awesome. It makes it makes sounds when it makes sound when your phone is on on standby when you have a new mail or anything. Um, there's other than that. Other than that, this is how it really. It's really simple to operate. Um, there's your speakers. I don't really care about speakers, but your speakers are your speakers. It's like a little better than your uh, plastic speakers, but these are like more like metal, metalish and hard, hard. So the speakers are actually better to me, I think. That's on my. That's on. That's some full blast. Oh, there's there's also amp, more amps in uh, music player, but this is this is how your music player looks. Yeah. Let me turn that off. Okay. Um. There's installed already a ESPN amp on the front page. I, I like this. It gives you the headlines and the score scores, like top scores, top scores, the latest top videos, spotlight. You know, I like some people like ESPN amps. Um, this is how your browser is. This is your ESPN page on desktop mode. What else? Okay, almost done here. So everything, la 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 la. You cannot custom. There's no such thing as background, background wall wallpaper because there is no wallpaper. Um. So the for uh final final demonstration will be the camera. Uh, you could always click here for to pop up the camera, or you could just click on the the camera button here, and you'll go to the camera. So I will shoot this raw, and I will upload the raw video footage. So you guys could have the is that uh, video quality that I shot it with? Here it is. So this is the exact um, Lumia 920 video footage, and this is on low light. Just I just got a lamp going on to light in this room, and this is how it is. So that will be uh, raw footage. It will be linked under the description to that footage, and I set it up to 1080p. So this is it. Um, this is your Lumia 920, and I I thought it would be worse than the like the iPhone or the like any other smaller Android phones, but I'm pretty impressed. Um, if I have, if this has a fantastic battery life, and I enjoy it, enjoy this, um, I will definitely get another, the latest Lumia, Nokia Lumia. I'll, uh, I'll probably get the 10, 1020 next, cause I don't, I don't think they'll make another camera better than the 1020 until five more years, so. I'm pretty impressed by the Lumia series, and if you are very into taking videos and um, 
taking still photographs, then I think this is the exact exact smartphone to go. Go with the Nokia Lumia series, and you will not be um, you will not be disappointed. So this is just my quick view quick view of this new um, smart camera phone that I got, and I'm really really liking it. So thanks Lumia for creating such technology and thanks for watching.